Florence Henderson, an accomplished actress and singer, left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Born on February 14, 1934, in Dale, Indiana, Henderson grew up in a large family and discovered her love for performing at a young age. After attending the American Academy of Dramatic Arts in New York City, Henderson made her Broadway debut in the musical Wish You Were Here in 1952. She went on to appear in several other Broadway productions, including Fanny and The Sound of Music. However, Henderson is perhaps best known for her role as Carol Brady on the beloved television show The Brady Bunch, which aired from 1969 to 1974. As the warm and nurturing mother of six children, Henderson won over audiences and became a household name. After The Brady Bunch ended, Henderson continued to act in various television shows, movies, and stage productions. She also hosted her own talk show, The Florence Henderson Show, and competed on Dancing with the Stars in 2010. Throughout her career, Henderson received numerous accolades for her contributions to the entertainment industry. She was inducted into the Broadcasting Hall of Fame in 2013 and received a Lifetime Achievement Award from the Daytime Emmys in 2017. Henderson passed away on November 24, 2016, but her legacy lies on through her memorable performances and the impact she had on generations of fans. Her ability to bring joy and laughter to audiences will always be cherished. Florence Henderson was a beloved American actress, best known for her role as Carol Brady on the TV show The Brady Bunch. She was born in 1934 and passed away in 2016. Henderson was more than just an actress. She was a singer, dancer, and television personality. Do you have a personal story of how Florence Henderson has inspired or impacted your life? We would love to hear it in the comments below. Are you aware of any interesting facts or anecdotes about Florence Henderson that not many people know? Let us know in the comments. What is your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic star? Share it with us in the comments section. Throughout her career, Henderson has had many funny, shocking, and sad moments. Keep watching this video to learn more about them. Remember, we would love to hear your stories and memories of this iconic actress, so don't forget to share them in the comments below. Florence Henderson, a beloved actress, was born and raised in Dale, Indiana, in a large family of 10 children. Her parents, sharecroppers who later became a restaurateur and a homemaker, instilled in her a strong work ethic and a love for performing. Henderson's first exposure to the craft of acting came through her participation in school plays and choir. Henderson's early influences included her mother, who encouraged her to pursue her dreams, and her high school drama teacher, who recognized her talent and helped her secure a scholarship to the American Academy of Dramatic Arts in New York City. At the Academy, Henderson studied under the guidance of renowned acting coach Uta Hagen, who became a key mentor and had a profound impact on her career. Hagen's emphasis on emotional honesty and truthful acting helped shape Henderson's approach to her craft and laid the foundation for her future success. Henderson's talent and determination led her to become the first woman to host The Tonight Show, and she later achieved international fame for her role as Carol Brady on The Brady Bunch. Despite her success, Henderson remained humble and dedicated to her craft, always striving to improve and learn from those around her. Florence Henderson was an influential actress in the film industry, particularly during her era and beyond. She is best known for her role as Carol Brady in the popular TV show The Brady Bunch, which aired from 1969 to 1974. Henderson's portrayal of the warm, nurturing mother figure was groundbreaking and helped to shape the image of the modern American family on television. Henderson's contribution to Hollywood went beyond her work on The Brady Bunch. She was a trailblazer for women in the entertainment industry, becoming the first woman to guest host The Tonight Show in 1962. She also hosted her own talk show, The Florence Henderson Show, and appeared as a guest star on numerous other TV shows and movies. In addition to her work in television, Henderson was also a successful stage actress. She made her Broadway debut in the musical Wish You Were Here in 1952, and went on to appear in several other Broadway productions, including Oklahoma and The Sound of Music. Henderson's impact on the film industry is still felt today. Her ability to portray complex and relatable characters helped to pave the way for future generations of actresses. 
she was a true pioneer and her legacy continues to inspire and influence performers today. In conclusion, Florence Henderson was a highly influential actress who made significant contributions to the film industry. Her work on The Brady Bunch helped to shape the image of the modern American family, and her trailblazing role as a woman in the entertainment industry continues to inspire and influence performers today. Florence Henderson, the beloved actress best known for her role as Carol Brady on The Brady Bunch, discovered her passion for performing at a young age. Growing up in Indiana, she was the youngest of 10 children in a family that struggled financially. Despite these challenges, Henderson's talent for singing and acting shone through. At the age of 12, Henderson was chosen to perform a solo in her church's Christmas pageant. The experience of performing on stage and hearing the audience's applause solidified her desire to pursue a career in the arts. After high school, Henderson attended the American Academy of Dramatic Arts in New York City, where she honed her craft and began to make a name for herself in the theater world. Henderson's big break came in 1952 when she was cast in the Broadway production of Wish You Were Here. Her performance caught the attention of producers and directors, leading to roles in television and film. However, it was her role as Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch that made her a household name and endeared her to audiences around the world. Despite her success, Henderson remained humble and dedicated to her craft. She continued to perform on stage, in film, and on television throughout her career, inspiring generations of actors and actresses along the way. Henderson's passion for performing and her dedication to her craft serve as a reminder of the power of perseverance and the importance of following one's dreams. Florence Henderson is best known for her role as Carol Brady in the popular 1970s TV show, The Brady Bunch. Interestingly, actress Joyce Bulifant was initially promised the part but it was later offered to Henderson when she became available. Gillifant went on to appear in other shows, including The Bill Cosby Show and The Mary Tyler Moore Show. Ironically, both she and Robbie Rist, who played Cousin Oliver on The Brady Bunch, appeared together in another Sherwood Schwartz show called Big John, Little John. In addition to her role as Carol Brady, Henderson and Eve Plum, who played Jan Brady, both portrayed March sisters in TV movie versions of Little Women. Henderson played Meg in the 1958 CBS musical version, while Plum played Beth in a 1978 version that also starred Susan Day as Joe and Meredith Baxter as Meg. Henderson reprised her role as Carol Brady in the 1995 movie The Brady Bunch Movie. At the end of the film, she appears alongside Shelley Long and is holding a bottle of Wesson cooking oil. Coincidentally, Henderson made a series of TV commercials for Wesson in the 1990s. Florence Henderson, the actress best known for her role as Carol Brady on The Brady Bunch, faced many challenges on her path to success. Growing up in a large, poor family in Indiana, Henderson learned to rely on her resilience and determination from an early age. Despite facing financial struggles and industry skepticism, she found creative solutions to overcome these hurdles. Henderson's family could not afford to send her to college so she worked multiple jobs to save enough money to attend the American Academy of Dramatic Arts in New York City. However, even after graduating, she faced rejection and discrimination in the entertainment industry. At the time, few roles were available for actresses who did not fit the traditional mold of leading ladies, and Henderson was told she was too ethnic to play the romantic lead. Undeterred, Henderson turned to musical theater, where she could showcase her talent and versatility. She appeared in numerous Broadway productions, including the original cast of Oklahoma, and became the first woman to host The Tonight Show. Henderson's warm personality and infectious energy made her a natural fit for television, and she went on to host several successful daytime talk shows. In 1969, Henderson was cast as Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch, a role that would define her career and endear her to generations of fans. Despite the show's initial failure, Henderson's portrayal of the wise and loving mother struck a chord with audiences, and the show became a cultural phenomenon. Throughout her career, Henderson faced numerous obstacles, from financial struggles to industry skepticism. However, she never let these challenges define her. Instead, she used her resilience and creativity to find new opportunities and make a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. Her legacy continues to inspire and entertain audiences to this day.
Florence Henderson is best known for her role as Carol Brady in the classic TV show, The Brady Bunch. Initially, Sherwood Schwartz offered the role of Mike Brady to Bob Holliday, who had recently played Superman in a Broadway musical. However, due to Holliday's lack of on-camera experience, the network cast Robert Reed instead. Holliday later retired from acting and started a home construction business. Later, Henderson was offered the role of Grandma in the Brady Bunch movie, which she publicly opposed until a rewrite provided a better part. Henderson had constantly lobbied the producers of the Brady Bunch to allow Carol Brady to work outside the home as it aligned with her real-life personality. However, the producers kept the character unemployed, limiting her to volunteer work and charity fundraising. Despite this, Henderson's portrayal of Carol Brady remains iconic, and her impact on popular culture continues to resonate today. Florence Henderson's career had several breakthrough moments that highlighted her talent and versatility. One of her earliest significant roles was in the original Broadway production of Oklahoma in 1943 when she was only 18. Her performance caught the attention of critics and audiences alike, setting the stage for her future success. Later, Henderson became the first woman to host The Tonight Show, filling in for Johnny Carson in 1962. This opportunity showcased her charm and wit, making her a household name and paving the way for future female hosts. However, Henderson's most iconic role was as Carol Brady in the hit TV show The Brady Bunch, which aired from 1969 to 1974. Her portrayal of the warm, nurturing mother figure resonated with audiences and solidified her status as a beloved television star. Henderson's impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable. According to her peers and collaborators, she was a trailblazer who broke down barriers for women in television and theater. Her ability to connect with audiences and bring joy to their lives is a testament to her enduring legacy. In addition to her acting career, Henderson was also a talented singer and appeared in numerous musical productions throughout her career. Her performance in the 1970s TV special The Sound of Music 25th Anniversary received critical acclaim and further solidified her status as a versatile performer. Overall, Florence Henderson's career was marked by groundbreaking roles, recognition, and critical acclaim. Her contributions to the entertainment industry continue to resonate with audiences today, making her a true icon in the world of television and theater. Florence Henderson is best known for playing Carol Brady in the popular 1970s TV show, The Brady Bunch. However, many people may not know that Joyce Bulefant was originally cast as Carol, and Kathleen Freeman was set to play Alice. When Henderson was cast as Carol, Ann B. Davis was given the part of Alice to keep things balanced. In addition to the Brady Bunch, Henderson also appeared in the comedy series Police Squad. Each week featured a special guest star who was killed off in the opening credits. Henderson was shot during a musical number. The Brady Kids was an animated spinoff of The Brady Bunch, featuring the voices of the six Brady kids along with Larry Storch and Jane Webb. Mike, Carol, and Alice did not appear, and the kids were accompanied by a dog, two pandas, and a talking magician minor bird named Marlin. Henderson and Ann B. Davis were angry about being excluded from the series. Sherwood Schwartz, the creator of The Brady Bunch, was unhappy with the animated series, stating that filmation veered off course for what he planned, and he was not given script approval. Despite this, Schwartz worked with Filmation again on the new adventures of Gilligan and Gilligan's Planet. In the second season of The Brady Kids, three of the kids, Barry Williams, Maureen McCormick, and Christopher Knight quit. Filmation responded by getting replacement actors and then suing them for breach of contract. In summary, Florence Henderson's career went beyond her iconic role as Carol Brady, including her appearance in Police Squad and her exclusion from the animated series The Brady Kids. Despite some challenges, Henderson's contributions to television remain noteworthy. Florence Henderson, best known for her role as Carol Brady on The Brady Bunch, had a unique approach to her work as an actress. She was dedicated to understanding her characters fully, often creating detailed backstories for them that went beyond what was written in the script. Henderson believed that this level of preparation helped her to bring depth and authenticity to her performances. Henderson's personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in her work. Growing up in a large family, she was able to draw upon her own background to inform her portrayal of Carol Brady, a mother of six. 
Henderson's warm and nurturing personality shone through in her performance, making the character relatable and endearing to audiences. In addition to her work on The Brady Bunch, Henderson had a successful career on stage, appearing in numerous Broadway productions. She also hosted her own talk show, The Florence Henderson Show, where she interviewed celebrities and discussed a variety of topics. Henderson's versatility as an actress and her ability to connect with audiences made her a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Henderson's artistic vision was characterized by her commitment to authenticity and her dedication to understanding the characters she portrayed. Her unique approach to her work, combined with her personal experiences and worldview, helped to create a distinct style that resonated with audiences. Henderson's legacy as an actress continues to inspire and influence performers today. Florence Henderson made history as the first woman to guest host The Tonight Show starring Johnny Carson in 1962. She is best known for her role as Carol Brady in the popular television show, The Brady Bunch. Henderson, along with Ann B. Davis, is the only cast member to appear in all five of the series reunion specials, including The Brady Bunch Variety Hour, The Brady Girls Get Married, The Brady Brides, A Very Brady Christmas, and The Bradys. When Henderson arrived to do her screen test for The Brady Bunch, she found herself in the makeup chair between William Shatner and Leonard Nimoy, who were filming Star Trek at the time. Henderson recalls that both actors completely ignored her during the makeup process. Despite this less than welcoming introduction to the set, Henderson went on to become a beloved television mother figure, and her portrayal of Carol Brady remains iconic to this day. Florence Henderson was a beloved actress, best known for her role as Carol Brady on The Brady Bunch. Her impact and influence on the industry are significant. Henderson was one of the first mothers on television who wasn't a housewife or a nurse, but a career woman, which was groundbreaking at the time. She paved the way for future actresses to portray complex and multidimensional characters. Henderson's performance as Carol Brady resonated with audiences and became an enduring symbol of the idealized American family. Her warm and nurturing presence on screen brought comfort and joy to millions of viewers. According to industry expert Robert Thompson, Florence Henderson was the embodiment of the perfect TV mom, and her influence can still be felt today in the way that mothers are portrayed on television. Henderson's impact extends beyond just acting. She was also a singer, dancer, and game show host, demonstrating her versatility as a performer. Her contributions to the entertainment industry have been recognized with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Moreover, Henderson was a trailblazer for women in the industry. She was the first woman to guest host The Tonight Show, and she was also the first woman to host her own daytime talk show. Her influence has inspired many women in the industry to pursue careers behind the camera as well as in front of it. In conclusion, Florence Henderson's contributions to the entertainment industry are significant and far-reaching. Her groundbreaking portrayal of a career woman and mother on The Brady Bunch her versatility as a performer, and her trailblazing role as a woman in the industry have left an indelible mark on the world of television. As actress Maureen McCormick, who played her daughter Marcia on The Brady Bunch, said, Florence was a wonderful woman, a great friend, and an amazing talent. She will be deeply missed, but her impact will live on forever. Florence Henderson is best known for her role as Carol Brady in the popular 1970s sitcom, The Brady Bunch. In a memorable appearance on the Naked Gun 3313, The Final Insult, she humorously recreated her iconic Brady Bunch pose. Henderson's singing experience made her a natural fit for the Brady Bunch Variety Hour, where she sang and danced alongside her co-stars. Behind the scenes, Henderson dealt with personal struggles. She was widowed after her second husband, Dr. John Kappas, passed away. The two had met when Kappas, a hypnotherapist, helped Henderson overcome depression during the mid-1980s. Kappas also trained Henderson in hypnotherapy, enabling her to become a licensed hypnotherapist in California. Henderson's career and personal life are a testament to her strength and resilience. Florence Henderson, best known for her role as Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch, had a rich and fulfilling life outside of her acting career. She valued family, hard work, and giving back to the community. Henderson was a dedicated philanthropist, often using her platform to raise awareness and funds for various causes. 
One of Henderson's most notable philanthropic efforts was her work with the March of Dimes, an organization dedicated to improving the health of mothers and babies. She served as the national spokesperson for the organization for many years and was passionate about their mission. Henderson was also involved in various other causes throughout her life, including supporting the troops, advocating for women's heart health, and raising awareness for Alzheimer's disease. She believed in using her influence to make a positive impact on the world and was always looking for ways to give back. In addition to her philanthropic work, Henderson had a deep love for music and theater. She began her career on Broadway and continued to perform in various stage productions throughout her life. Henderson believed that the arts had the power to bring people together and was a strong advocate for arts education. Henderson's personal values and interests often informed her work both on and off the screen. She brought a sense of warmth, kindness, and generosity to every project she worked on, and her philanthropic efforts were a reflection of her deep commitment to making the world a better place. In summary, Florence Henderson was not only a talented actress, but also a dedicated philanthropist and advocate for various causes. Her personal values and interest in music, theater, and giving back to the community shaped her work and left a lasting impact on those around her. Florence Henderson, best known for playing Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch, made a cameo in The Brady Bunch movie. Initially, she declined the role due to her dislike for the scene. However, after test screenings criticized her absence, producers convinced her to appear, giving her control over the scene and additional compensation. Despite the Brady Bunch's filming location in Los Angeles, Henderson frequently traveled to New York City every weekend to be with her family. Interestingly, Henderson portrayed three generations of Brady women, including Carol, her mother, and her grandmother, Connie Hutchins, in the episode You're Never Too Old from Season 4. Her remarkable range and dedication to her craft are evident in her ability to convincingly play three different characters within the same family. Florence Henderson, best known for her role as Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch, left a lasting impact on the television industry. She was a trailblazer for women in television, breaking barriers and paving the way for future generations. Her warm and nurturing character on screen brought comfort and joy to many households. For those aspiring to follow in her footsteps, Henderson offered valuable advice always be true to yourself and never give up on your dreams. She emphasized the importance of hard work, persistence, and staying grounded in one's values. Henderson's legacy serves as a reminder that the entertainment industry is not just about fame and fortune, but about using one's talents to make a positive impact on others. As we look to the future, it is essential to build upon the foundation laid by pioneers like Henderson, continuing to push for progress and representation in the industry. In conclusion, aspiring professionals can learn from Henderson's legacy and approach their careers with authenticity, determination, and a commitment to making a difference. By doing so, they can honor her contributions and help shape the future of the entertainment industry. Let's take a moment to remember the wonderful Florence Henderson, an actress well known for her role as Carol Brady in The Brady Bunch. Her work brought joy and laughter to many households across the country. If you have any memories or thoughts about her and her career, please share them in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Her legacy continues to live on through her many performances, and she has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. If you enjoyed this tribute, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content celebrating the lives and careers of the talented individuals who have shaped the world of entertainment. Thank you for joining us as we remember and celebrate the life of Florence Henderson. Her work will continue to be cherished for generations to come. So, let's keep her memory alive by sharing our thoughts and memories in the comments below.